as we bring a lot of software-driven, sensor-based technologies inside the cockpit, the complexity can often be overwhelming for our consumers. The expectation has been that the user adapts to the systems. We don't believe that's the right approach. And fortunately, we now have the technology to address that issue. And that technology is artificial intelligence, or machine learning to be exact. And we are showing two products in this space. Say and Serve is our voice technology. Think of it as Alexa for your car, but without necessarily requiring cloud connectivity. You hear a lot about artificial intelligence and how, uh, how it's used, but it's mainly used on servers, it's mainly used in the cloud. We are working since two years already to bring it to embedded devices. So if we build a purpose-built AI processor that has the compilers, has the libraries, has all the processing power on the inside, that system has the ability to learn you in a natural way, learn your accent, learn the way that you speak to the system. Nowadays, people are used to uh, the Alexas and Google, and uh, they would want a similar experience inside the car. So you don't have to worry about speaking in a specific way to the system. So it really understands, and it really helps the driver distraction a lot. And moving into the autonomous world, there is a lot of things that you can do with voice. For example, you could have an office setup. You could do a lot more things more efficiently within the vehicle. It gets better with use over time, and that means that the system is more intuitive. It responds to the user the way the user expects it to, and does not create that intimidation factor that stops most people from fully taking advantage of the capabilities of the system. On the other side, we have see and sense, which is a driver monitoring system and is able to detect the person's face, track their eye gaze, and do other things that are required for a very complete driver monitoring solution. The interaction between the, either the passenger in the car or even the driver in the car will get easier. You don't have to specifically press any buttons or do much. The car will be able to understand you and do things very intuitively like you can use it for driver distraction. So if a driver is looking away from the road, you'll be able to know immediately that he's looking away from the door and send an alert. So this we believe is the next wave for us in automotive. The technologies are there, the capabilities are there, and clearly the market demand is there. So that's what Vistion will be focusing on going into the future.